Hi all and uh, welcome back to this small help video. Today we are going to talk about problems with connecting to your access points and Wi-Fi and uh, make sure to be in the range of your access point and not have a poor connection. So step a bit closer uh, when you are doing these 10 steps that I have for you today that you can try to solve your Wi-Fi problems. I will come back to this Wi-Fi access point later, so I will put that aside and uh, get started. First of all, the first point that you probably already have done is to try to turn off and on your Wi-Fi. And you can do that by this or go into settings, go into your Wi-Fi and up here you can turn off like this and on again and let's have a look and see if it actually works now. The second point is actually the Bluetooth. Bluetooth can actually do some uh, damage to your Wi-Fi uh, connection and uh, I've seen it quite a couple of times with friends. So uh, go in, try to turn off your Bluetooth and see if your Wi-Fi is now working. Third point is to try to go into airplane mode you can put on airplane mode, wait for 30 seconds and uh, turn it off again and see if your Wi-Fi is getting better. You can also do the airplane mode up here, turn it on, wait for 30 seconds and off again. Next point is to of course try and restart your device. I have an iPad right here and I'm going to push the power button and you will get this screen swipe and you will turn off your device wait for a few seconds turn it on again and see what is going on with your wi-fi so that's also a very good solution and you probably heard it before restarting devices computer iphones ipads whatever that actually helps sometimes the next thing is your, your access point, your router, whatever you have, you are having your wireless connection through. I have a access point right here. I can unplug my cable, the power cable, put it in again, wait for a minute or two to get your access point up and running again, and then see if your Wi-Fi is actually working again. A lot of times access points is actually the problem and not the device so please make sure also to have a look at your access points your router whatever you have so see if that is actually causing your Wi-Fi problems all right going to the next one is actually the location service if you go into uh, privacy down here on your iPad or whatever device you have Go into location service, go down at the bottom, we have this system services. And in here we have this Wi-Fi networking. Turn that off and that can actually help your Wi-Fi working again. So uh, turn off your location service for the Wi-Fi networking. All right, let's go into the network settings. I have my Wi-Fi here push that button at the right side and you will get into different configuration settings for your Wi-Fi on this device. And the first one we are going to do in here is to forget this network. Press this one and uh, pr press the red forget button and your Wi-Fi will be lost on your device. You will have to reconnect, put in your password for your Wi-Fi again and all that and let's see if uh, it is actually working with that one. So forget network was the next one. And then we can look at the configuration of the DNS. And in here you can actually put in uh, your own manual DNS. I will just make sure to delete this one that I put in. Go here, add server and uh, you can use a Google DNS server that is having the address 8.8.8.8. Close this one down. And you will have to press save. 
and then you will actually be able to solve your problems because now you can delete your own one press this one and press delete and you will actually be using the DNS of Google instead of your internet provider so that can also be a probable a good solution to Wi-Fi problems all right next one is under general and if you go down to the bottom we have this reset and in here we have the third option we have reset and network settings press this one and you have to put in your passcode you will have to press reset and your device will reset your network settings so that's also a proper solution and a good way to uh, reset all the network software uh, settings on your device and uh, that can often help solve your Wi-Fi problems and the last one is to make sure that your device is up to date with your software uh, if you go in here and go up to the top again you go in software update and mine is actually up to date at the moment so I will not have any updates to install but make sure that your device is up to date with the latest version that can actually cause some issues so that was all for me today I had 10 points 10 steps that you could uh, try out on your device and see if that can solve your Wi-Fi problem I hope it helped uh, if you like this video then uh, please make a subscription to my channel and I'll see you soon again